Hello, MJCA, and welcome to this beautiful night of basketball. I'm your host, Ethan Palmer, and alongside me is Blake Branham. How's it going, Blake? Pretty darn good. It's going pretty good, isn't it? Yes, it is. It's looking to be a great basketball game out here. Just great. Great. We got Madison versus the MJCA Saints in a thriller, straight-up thriller. I'll be working the camera. Blake will be producing the game. Brandon Wall takes it up the court. <laughs> nice pass. Jackson Harrell with the jump shot. Just a little bit off, gets his own rebound, and throws it out of bounds. That's, that's a shame. That is a shame. He, he worked really hard on that hustle right there. He did. He did. Okay. That guy's pretty oh. tall. Going down the court, mm. and something's happening right now. That's a 
nice pass by Trevor West up to Jackson Harrell for the slam dunk. Mm. Shame again. What a shame. Jackson Harrell is actually one of the better players on the team, a good friend of mine. Great man. Jackson and James Laxton are James Laxton. top notch players with this team. He's really a quality role player they have coming off the bench. He really is. Scores in bunches that one. Oh, Jackson Harrell down again. And something happened. Oh, that can't. Well, you know, that's not exactly what I saw right there, but it's the other team's ball. It is, it is. Oh, a kind of a wild throw in there by uh, number 25. It is dead quiet. In yeah, the somebody needs to make some noise. You know what I'm saying? I know what you're saying. Pass into Brandon Wall, corner three. And that looked like it was going in, ladies and gentlemen. But it did not. Down the floor. They're going to slow up the pace a little bit here. Oh, sweet stroke by number 25. It's okay, rebound, Madison. The Saints have gotten off to a little bit of a slow start here. Oh, and a steal by Jackson Harrell. Well, that was that was kind of a strange play, Blake. Did you see what happened there? I did not. I think they can probably hear us a little better now. Turn the volume up. I really so they could barely hear us before. Yes, but now we're good. All they right. should hear us fully. So I'm Ethan Ballmer, and this is Blake Branham, and we are doing the broadcast. Great pass. Oh, 25. Oh, Zach Jones with the absolute swatter right there. Down the floor, Brandon Wall passing it up to Trevor. And corner for number 11, Trevor. Getting his own rebound. Talk about a hustle play, Blake. Could you define it any better? I could not. And a steal by Zach Jones. Good play by Trevor. Pass to Brandon, corner. And he's taking that three. And he misses that three. Zach Jones made up for it though, and he got a foul. So good, good work there. Brendan Wall is really the sharpshooter of the of the Saints' offensive attack. Yes. And I'm being dead serious there. He's actually probably the best shooter on the team. Great. Oh well. Oh, nice, nice pass there. Time out. Time out, Mount Juliet Saints. We will be right back. With these messages. And we're back. Welcome back to the game. It's a good one here. Score two to two. It's a close one. Pass inbounds to <laughs> number one. Number one passing it to number four. Oh, number good, twenty-four good try gets there. it, and number this twenty-seven good, gets it now. Good hustle. Uh, pass it around. Eleven. One of the bright young stars on this team. 23 gets it now. 20. Don't say their numbers if you know their names. Number 11 passes to Zach Jones. Tyler, or Trevor West to Brandon Wall. Back to Trevor West. Back to Brandon Wall. Into Zach Jones, and he's a monster. And he misses. And he 
He got that foul, though. You got to give him credit for that yeah. foul. Very true. He knows how to get to the line, and that's something that we've seen just over and over from him. Over and over. He's got a pretty good uh, free throw stroke, too, as you guys are about to see. Take my word on it. Look at that. Did I, did I not tell you what was just get, about to go down? And Jackson Harrell's coming back in. So is Brandon Wall. And Zach Jones makes it, he makes it two for two, just on a sweet stroke, both, both layups right there. Or layups, swishes, what am I saying? Oh, I don't know what you're saying, some really. Full pressure defense, and looks like Alex Grave got Graves got a little bit of a, of a bonker there. <laughs> Pass into Zach Jones. Oh no, right through the legs. Dribbling. Pass inside, number 11. Oh wow, what a post move! He got his own. That is a foul, ladies and gentlemen. As much as I, as much as I don't like to admit it, that was a foul. The cheerleaders are doing cheers without saying a word. Jones. What an oddity! Everyone is dead silent. Yeah, but what is some, the stadium needs to get a little bit louder here? I'm perplexed. Good job, good shot. Brennan Wall coming up into Jackson, jump shot, and those will fall about nine out of 10 times. But not this time. But not this time. Number one, passing into number four. Number four, up at the top of the key to 11. Back to the basket, back to one. Number 45, inside, what a, oh. Well, it just kind of mishandled there. What a shame. Would have made it a nice highlight reel. Brandon Wall, inside, Zach Jones, pump fake. Outside, Trevor West, that's it. That's it. What did I say? What did I tell you, Mount Julia? That was a three-pointer. Three-pointer? That was a three-pointer. Holy smokes. Creeping crocodiles, Batman. That's a smooth jumper right there. That is jazz smooth right there. Inside Zach Jones, he's a beast. Give it to him, give him the two points. Now you start to hear the fans erupt a little bit. They got something to cheer about. Nice. Oh, nice skill by Trevor, he's going in. And that's a layup, that's a layup by Trevor West, ladies and gentlemen. A layup at its finest. That's a timeout. We'll be back to you right after these messages. Welcome back to the game. Just got really quiet in here. I don't know why. Trevor West. Trevor West is just racking up those steals. Steal after steal after steal. And Zach Jones. Oh, got to be ready for it. Good idea from uh, Zach Jones there. Nice pass in. I am sorry about the camera work, ladies and gentlemen. I think it looks pretty good. Oh, that two points. That's JCA top. State. That is top ten sports center worthy. Top five. Trying to one up me? Maybe. Did not think so. Do not try to one up me. Oh my goodness, this camera angle. And we are blocked by the railing. We're sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Will you be able to see really soon? Uh, there we go. Number one, dribbling up. Like a complete boss. Mm. Oh, oh, hard foul there. Think it'll be a flagrant? 
You don't know what that is. I do not what, know what that is, but yes. It's all right. You'll 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 figure it out soon enough. Look at that student, student section. We are just proud to have one of the greatest student sections in the mid-state. In the world. I think you're pushing it, but I'd definitely say mid-state. State, they're, maybe? They're a rambunctious few. Number four is fast mm. and misses. Hey, you cannot fault that guy's effort, though. Jackson, that's just, mm. well, oh, look at him. Is he going to dunk it? Nope. Oh, almost and one. Truly, truly phenomenal. I think this is a good matchup for the uh, Madison team. Yes, I, I concur. Against the MJCA Saints, they seem to really know each other, match up well. Their posts, their guards, their forwards. Oh. All right, well, here's the second free throw attempt. Oh, and it's, it's out. So Madison not able to capitalize on their opportunities there. Not able to capitalize one bit. But I think they do have the ball back, don't they? Yes. They do have the ball back. And I'm sorry for the camera again. This rail is just getting in my gosh darned way. Oh, sheesh. Pass inside, and you know that's right. Number Oh, well, I did not know that's right. Looks oh. like Madison's ball. It is Madison's ball. Number 15 is passing in here. And that rail again. I don't know what I'm going to do with that rail. Nice steal by Brandon Wall. Pass inside Jackson Harrell. Lay up all day long. All day long, Blake. I tell you what, that is one of the best basketball players we have on our team. Number one, just dribbling circles. If he makes, oh, okay, well. You see how he just dribbled circles around our defense there? I did. That's some good ball work right wow. there. Wow. Okay, 11 got on the fast break into 35. Was that, did Trevor really just say that? That, better capitalize that on, capitalize on that boys, excuse me. My, my tongue slipped. Welcome back, sorry. <laughs> Good steal by, who is that, Alex Graves? Getting himself the two free throws and a chance at some easy points. Easy peasy lemon squeeze. That's what they used to say in the old country. They did. Tractors and oxen and plows. And tigers and bears, oh my. Did he make that free throw? He did not. He did, he not. did not. It's okay. He has a chance to make another one because he's going for two. Good form. Good form. Good job on Jackson drawing that foul right there. And we got about a minute left in the first quarter. What, what have you thought about the game so far, Blake? You get any good vibes from it? Bad vibes? What's going on here? Good vibes. Very, very, very good vibes. It looks like it looks like we're gonna be able to uh, play well this game. We've this had a couple. We had a couple of miss uh, missteps, but overall, it's a pretty decent performance in the first quarter. It's epic. It's epic. It is epic. If I if I could describe it in one way. Four. This is the game of the century. Now, of the millennium. I don't know. MJ's game against the Jazz back in the 80s when he had a cold and scored 40 points. That was a pretty good game. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. I do. Yeah, he knows what I'm talking about. 
I know what you're talking about. The late, the, I was about to say the late great Michael Jordan, but he is not dead. He's actually the owner. He's of not, the, I thought he was dead. No, he's the owner of the Charlotte Bobcats, oh, which wow. is kind of up on the rise lately, honestly. You learn something new every oh, day? Oh, number four. Man, if he could if he could just perfect his, his touch around the basket, you know that kid would be getting mm -hmm. you know it for a fact. about 15, 20 points a game. Zach like Jones. You know, even when it doesn't go in, it looks like it's going to go in. That's just Zach Jones. Number four. Look at him. He is just blowing past the defense. But, you know, he really – he really shouldn't be taking those shots. Looking for open men, you know, trying to trying to pass the ball around. Well, that's the end of the first quarter, folks. Um, we'll be right back after these short messages. Love you. And welcome back. Second quarter action here, live from the track. Number four, just Speedy Gonzalez passing inside. Oh, contested shot. Probably shouldn't have taken that. Trevor that West. That would be an air court. ball. That would be an air ball. 45. That's Jackson. Oh, Zach came in there with swinging the ax. Oh, he's down. He's down, ladies and gentlemen. Take a knee. No, oh, he's up. I called that one too fast. Oh, do you hear that, ladies and gentlemen? That is the sound of the MJCA student section coming alive. Like a wild animal. I believe that's what our name is, the animals. I think it's the snakes. No, I mean, like, that's what they call the student section sometimes. Because oh. they have those T-shirts that say animals on them. Oh, yeah, yeah. Which doesn't make much sense, but I'll take it. Animals are pretty scary. They, they look pretty scary over there, actually. I would not mess with that bunch of people. Goodness, that almost went in. But it did not. I don't know where the ball is, ladies and gentlemen. I apologize for that. Okay, I'm having a little bit of trouble here following the action, but Jackson Harold just missed a shot. 31 got the rebound. About to go back down the court. Number four, passing it around, 31, inside 11. Uh-oh, you're gonna have to work it around. Number four, oh, he can just not be taking those jump shots. I mean, he's a fantastic player, but you gotta know when to pass it. And Wyatt Oberg draws the foul. Good on you, Wyatt, good on you. Foul of Austin Johnson in just second, King Ford. And for the Saints, second. We got some subs, looks like, coming in here. Number 11. Not quite sure what his name is, but he's a rambunctious young, young scamp. Dude, I just, I'm a little bit nervous. You know, it's my first broadcast, guys. It's okay, Ethan. I'm here for you. Just, just don't, don't let me mess up, please. If, if you hear me say something, <laughs> why are you turning stuff up and turning stuff down over there? I had to cough, I'm sorry. Oh, okay, well, I kind of laughed a little bit when you were doing that, so. Pardon me. Good, good commentary there. Misses. You know, I mean, it's a fact. He missed the shot. So, uh. Makes. Blake, what are you thinking about the uh, New York Knicks run that's been going on a little bit here lately? Oh, I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. I'm a little bit distracted there, talking about the New York Knicks. Well, I will tell you one thing. What's that? 
No. I don't think any of us are. That's all I'm going to say about that. I don't think any of us are. I mean, you'd think with them losing Lynn, right? They just they just drop some scoring. But Hold everything. What's that? The score was wrong. It is updated now. Sorry about that, folks. You see, I'm not the only one messing up on this broadcast. It is also Blake. And look at that. Brandon Wall, good effort. Good job. Number 11 oh, is a feisty it. little person. Well, that was good. I mean, that's about the best effort I've seen all year out of this basketball team. Yep. Diving, straight up diving for right, that ball. Volleyball up in here. Can't even contain number 11. Oh. Can we can we just take a moment and zoom in on Coach Christensen's face? Hold on. Look how determined this man is. He wins Coach of the Year every single year. It is amazing how determined this man is. All right, that's about as much zooming in as I'm going to do. And we're back to the game. And it's back in bounds. Oh, look at that. Mm. Oh, that's a hard foul, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Looks like Superman. Well, I would and like, he hey, hey. Um, before we go any further, I would like to say a very happy birthday to Coach C. Yes. Everyone, if you are friends with him on Facebook, please send him a message and or call him or text him. He would love that. He's a very special man, near and dear to our hearts, no, and deserves some birthday wishes. Yeah, he's not very vocal, so he doesn't talk about it, so you probably wouldn't know it's his birthday today. I don't even know if he has it on Facebook that that's his birthday. Probably so not. So probably won't even say it. You're just going to have to write it on his wall. Or call him. Give him a call. Oh, it's okay. He Back to the game. That. Brandon Wall dribbling Back up. To the game. Jackson Harrell, back to Brandon. He's got Brandt open on the corner there. Well, now Brandt's covered. Brandon got the ball. And that's Jackson, three-pointer. You know, those are the type of shop, shot opportunities that you want, Blake, but they just haven't been seeming to go in for the uh, Saints. I know what you're talking about. <laughs> Make it. You know, good defense, good effort, but some things you just can't stop. I concur. Mm. Kick corner three, number eleven. I'd say this 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 guy has some bright years ahead with his future with this team. Who? Number eleven. Ah, uh, yeah. He's a hustler. He's got a good shot for him. He's a diver. He knows how to play. Well, no, don't say that because that just makes it sound like he fakes fouls. No, he's uh. he's he's very energetic and. And what? Somebody got a technical. Somebody got a technical. Who is it? Who will it be? I don't know. Eeny, meeny, miny, moe. Who got the technical? Jackson Harrell, Jackson Harrell got a technical foul. First. Not good. Coach C is not Maybe happy seven. with that. Not at all. It's okay. Jackson will rebound. I'm not exactly sure what you did. Did you catch it, Blake? I think you punched him. Are you? No. No? No, no. you can't punch somebody you and can't? get away with it oh. in basketball. Yeah. Come on. I was joking. That's a pretty hefty accusation there. Okay, he Shame didn't. on you, Blake. Oh, I didn't even film him. Let's not spread he made rumors that. here. He did not punch No, him. he did not. Um. So this guy made his first technical free throw. Missed his second. The score is now 21-14. Solid divisibles score of seven. The score is behind again. Our Sol producer is slacking. He Just is. Give him a second chance. You know what I really enjoy about this game? What? Divisibles of seven. Everything. <laughs> Everything is divisible by seven. Everything is divisible by seven. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. A small monkey came up and ripped my headset off. Better watch out for those things. They're feisty. Oh! Good hustle by Alex Graves. I tell you what, that kid wants to win, and he wants to win every day. Oh, okay. Oh, we're going to be passing it in from about half court, mid court, whichever you prefer. Pass to Brandon Wall, coming around the corner. Crossover. Nice pass, Jackson Harrell. 
looking to redeem himself. Oh, no, oh. Brandon Wall. Get back on defense. He's Oh, good defense by Brandon Wall. Uh-oh. Oh, my. And somehow, somehow, Madison still has the ball. And still has the ball. Well, no. It's, well, yeah, they still had the ball. They would have still had the ball. But a foul got called, unfortunately, on number 11. Well, no, unfortunately, it was the correct call. The refs are doing a great job. They should pay the – they should – Tip them. Give them extra money for these great calls. You really need to stop saying stuff like that. No, look at me. Why? That's not good. Why? We should not talk about the rest in a negative manner. No, I said they were they're giving good calls. We should give them extra money. Well, no, we you should never give money to the refs. That that is we do not advocate that here at NJCA. Blake Brandon might, but he is Obviously, meant, out of his mind. I meant raise their salary because they're they're making good calls. Why don't we just give them a pat? Teams. Why don't we just give them a pat on the back and occasionally oh, okay. send them a or... a basket full of chocolate or something? Okay, we can do that. Not money. We do not give money to the refs. No, we do not. That not even something to joke about. Okay, back to the game. Forty-five. Jackson Harrell just draws fouls like a foul Harrell magnet. Straight up foul magnet. You cannot say that this man plays uh, plays soft because he does not. You okay? I don't know what you're talking about. I heard that cough. All right. So Jackson, 0 for 2 from the free throw line right there. Number one, talented point guard. Nice pass. Oh, and Jackson Harrell. He's got a he's got a layup here if he, if he gets it, and good, good awareness, good running. I'd say about good overall play, coming from Jackson Harrell right there. The stadium needs to get loud. I'll tell you what. Oh wow, good ball movement by Madison, and I'd say they really deserve a shot or a, or a couple of points for their efforts. Nah. Wait. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Looked like a clean block to me, but uh, a foul was called. I'm not sure on who. Maybe Gilbert. Probably maybe Jackson. Jackson. Maybe Jackson. He's I don't that, know. He's that foul magnet. Well, I mean, he was a foul magnet in a good way, not a bad way. Oh, okay. And we have uh, Mr. Runyon here. Blake's mom up here visiting us in the booth. Blake, would you like to say a few words about how much you love your mother? Blake, nah. why are you silent right now? Nah. You're making me look crazy. Would you like Brent. to say a couple words? We need a guest speaker. No, you say okay. how the game's going. Just one word to sum up the game so far. Good. You heard it here first on MJCA Broadcasting. I don't know what our name is. I don't think it's MJ. We're back. Sorry. Just had to, you know. Go to the bathroom. Well, that was a record time, Blake. Record time. That's right. 15. Spinning the ball in his hand, and oh, that's going in it. all day long. The score is now 23 to 20, no longer divisible by seven. I don't know. Um, Okay, well, the camera is just not even on the action. Brent Lambert passing it inside, or not passing, he went for a shot, and our, number four. Our cameraman is slacking. I'm sorry, I just get distracted by things. Uh, 11, how could you, oh no, a couple people fell down. 15, that looked like it hurt. He's hustling, he's getting back. Wow, Jackson Harrell, jump shot. Good hustle by Brant Lambert. Jump ball, possession goes to the six. 
he knew that that position was coming back to us, so he, he fought tooth and nail. Wyatt Oberg coming in for the Saints. Number five, inbound in the pass. Passing in to Brandon. Brandon's uh, guarded closer by number four, and they're going to call a foul on number four. He does not look happy about that. Brandon Wall will be shooting free throws here. Is the camera line? Yes, it is. Yes, it is, Blake. Blake, you've been awfully quiet lately. What's uh, what have you what have you been thinking about during this game? How great this! I'm just mesmerized by the level of skill in this game. It's well, we got 126 left unmatched. to go. It, it is a close game. It could come down to the wire. Um, I'm not over exaggerating. When this could be a great game. I think it is a great game. Well, it already is, obviously. Brandon <laughs> Wall hitting the. Uh, Second free throw. They're playing. Saints are playing pressure, and the inbounder just threw it right out of bounds. And you don't want to do that. You don't want to give up easy points near the end no. of the half because that, that just gives the other team all the momentum. Yeah. But uh, all right, Wyatt Oberg inbounding it. Pass to uh, Brandon. Corner three. Oh. Yeah, I mean, you expect Brandon to hit those. Oh, uh, Brent Lambert again on the ground. I tell you what, he is. He hustles. Brandon Wall going up the court. Playing the point guard position at the moment. Pass into Brant. Brant's got nowhere to go. Back to Brandon. And that is wide over for the three. I'd say he took the right shot there. He missed it. Well, he took the right shot, and that's what counts, I mean. It's basketball. You can't always expect everyone to go in. They should, though. I think you're being overly optimistic. All right, Brandon Wall <laughs> dribbling inside. Just Oh, Brandon that did not just happen. It happened. Do my eyes deceive me? You know what I always say. What do you always say? You know, don't sweat the small stuff. And it's all small stuff. It is all small stuff. When you think about it, I mean... Not much stuff is big stuff. Not much. I mean, Except getting married, that's kind of big. You know, having, Dying. having a baby, that's pretty big. That's pretty big. I don't know what else will qualify as a Go, uh, is a big deal in your life. Winning the lottery, Most of the stuff in your life is small stuff, I'd say. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, what's going on here now? Because I just kind of started zoning out. You know, you know what else I always say? Well, we're not talking about that. I was trying to talk about the Don't game. You're just bringing an up another topic. Driver. I, that probably does cause about 50% of the accidents in America. And the camera was not on the action again. I apologize. About to fire this cameraman. You know how hard it is to commentate and do camera work at the same time. Do you time? know how hard it is to commentate and produce at the same time? It's about as hard as threading a needle. During the snowstorm. While it, a volcano was erupting next to you. Well, it's a snowstorm of ash. Oh, well, I knew that. I just I inferred that. Yeah. Sure, you did. All right. Yeah. Score is 27 25. Looks like the Saints are going to have the final possession. White Oberg dribbling it up to the left, passing it to Jackson Harold. Jackson Harold just looking for the open man, Brandt. Brent somehow got that ball back and in for the – oh, good. I mean, good on uh, Brent for making that hustle play and getting the ball and going in there. But, oh, I did not realize it's the Saints ball still. So, good job, Brent. That that was just a good play. Very good. What happened there? They called it foul on Brent. Foul on Brent Lambert is first. Wow. They obviously saw something that we didn't – but uh, Madison will get the ball back. Madison will inbound this pass. You know, so. Okay. Number four on the break. Take up that jump shot. Nine seconds left on the clock. 11's got it on the wing. Six. To five, one. Four. To four. Four three, for the three. Two. Oh, wow. One. Man. And that's half. 
We'll be right back with MJCA Basketball on the World Wide Web.
we're back. Whew. I didn't know if I could go another minute without hearing you, audience. It's been a long journey. Well, thank you, Mr. Blake, for touching my camera. It's my camera. I don't know what you're talking about. You also zoomed it in way too far away. So I there we go. In too far away? Yeah, zoomed out too far away. Zach Jones passing it up. I believe that's Trevor Jackson inside. And that's a miss. Fast break here for number one. Missing the layup. Zach Jones somehow got that inbound. And it drops for uh, Madison. That's 27 to 27. Brandon Wall up the court. Jackson Harrell spot up three. That's the shooting touch we were talking about at the beginning of the game. Yes. Oh, some action. Number one. Just dribbling circles around his opponents. 11. Misses. I feel like they kind of woke up after this half and they just didn't look back. Either team. Cameron Lusk is here to do a special guest commentating. Cameron, one word to describe this game. One word, Cameron. Just one. Titillating. Great word to describe this game. I believe Confucius made that word. And we have a special treat for you. The one, the only. You could already hear him. Dallas Hammer. You can tell it's him from a mile away. How's it going, guys? Oh, it's going, it's going great. There's only one of us now, because you took one of the mics. Yeah, I did. So, uh, what are you, what are you thinking about the game so far? It's just been a, a Sir great battle. battle, Sir Dallas Hammer. A great battle of, of, yes, wits. That's that's a good way to describe. I was it. about to say, I have no idea what you're talking about. Just the fundamentals being used. And can I just say, I hear every single crickle crackle coming from that plastic bag that Cameron Musk is. Is uh, operating. I can too, sir. Oh. Jackson Harrell inside. Jack with spin the spin. Oh. oh, well, you know what? I'm the main commentator here, so you can take your main commentating and get out. You are, you are a guest. That spin you are is. a guest in my home. Do not abuse the power. I'll try not to, sir. You better not. It's a timeout, folks. We're going to have a little break. There's that beautiful MJCA logo. And Blake, you want to cut us to a commercial? Blake. Blake, commercial. Fabulous producer. Would you like to cut us to a commercial? What? It's a timeout. You know. And we're back, and sorry we haven't cut onto the game yet. Blake's a little slow with the handling there. I'm also slow with the camera work. I'll take 50% of that blame. And I do nothing. I just talk. What a great pass. Clearance. Oh, there we go. Oh, is this a slam dunk I'm, I'm seeing? And that's a layup. Missed a layup at that. Go oh, and and one. I just like to comment real quick on how that number five kid on the bench looks extremely much like our comrade Will Burke. Um, I'm gonna take your word for it. He does. He does. Um, I, he does. Um. I didn't take my gum out. Oh, look. Oh, is that Bane down there in, in midcourt, number four? Oh, jeez. That man looks a lot like Bane. Dallas, if you're not going to say anything nice, don't say anything at all. Bane was a very strong man. Ladies and gentlemen, Dallas does not represent the uh, views and opinions of the MJCA Great broadcast Great play by team. Brandon. Great play. And nice basket by number one. You know, this might not be the best game MJCA has played, but the effort being executed is just oh, Did you great. see that number 11 kid? He was all over the place. He was. Great shot by Brandon there. Brent does. You know, they weren't scoring much before halftime, but now it's just the scoring 
frenzy going on right now. It's just this game is getting so erratic with with chaos and Alex Graves might just take it all the way, but he passes to Jackson Harrell, therefore declining taking it all the way. That's going to be free throws. You know, that was just a great, great unselfish play by Alex. Good pass. Oh. Way to draw the foul by one word Jackson. To one word to describe Alex Dallas. Go. Hair. His hair. It's just amazing. <laughs> hair. I'd say, I'd say I'd agree with that. It's just Bane-rific. Really got a reference Bane about every, every five seconds. It's my catchphrase. What can I say? I would do my Bane voice. I've heard it's pretty good. Try it. I don't know. I haven't done it in a while. This is live TV. You know, when Bane scores, when Bane scores the points, try it. We'll see what happens. <laughs> this is Gotham's liberation. Dude, was that Bane? Did Bane just come over? Oh, that was you? Yeah. That was a great job. Jackson Harrell. Ah, oh, he's just playing like a champ tonight. You can hear Cameron Lusk in the background. Let's that's, cut to the commercial. That's a timeout. We love you, Coach C. Yo, what's up, guys? We're back. Back in black. Speaking of black, I'm going to go play some Black Ops 2 right after this game. A great game released uh, early November. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I I went to the midnight release, and it was just the spirit. That's I was I was there oh, with man. you. I'm surprised you oh, do not yeah. remember. I, I didn't recognize you. I did get some facial reconstruction. Done since last time. Oh, oh great and steal. Alex Graves. Go. No, no. Oh, well, he he best be glad that he made that layup. He for 50 a second there, dunked it. Fifty percent dunked it. I'll call that a fifty percent. For a second there, it did not look like it was going in. But all credit to credit. Oh, to Bane, do. Bane with the ball. What can he do? Oh, oh. that one was for you, Gotham. <laughs> <laughs> That was Bain Riffle. Brandon Wall, Jackson Harrell, three-pointer, swish all day long. He has the purest shot on the team, just a pure shot. What did I tell you? You get him the Amazing. ball, he's going to score. Ha, who, who makes the net go up inside out? He's practically he the James Harden of this basketball team. Actually, I, I'd just like to put in that James Harden is a six-man. Well, he's a starter now in Houston. Get your facts straight. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Yes, thank you. Number one. Truly earning that position tonight. He's been playing phenomenal. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I, s I keep forgetting to spit out my gum before the we come back on air, and I apologize for that. You're probably just hearing me chew a lot. And that's not very attractive. All right, inbound. 24, going up the court. Number one. Dribble, dribble, pass. Just like I like it. That's a shot. That's a miss. Good rebound, bro. You no, know, we're doing a better job of boxing out, and I'm just liking it. I'm liking uh -oh. the change. Charles in charge. Oh, where's the transition no. D? What was it? It was a travel? I think that was a travel. How does one travel when he's got a free breakaway? That's a good job, good effort, though. Well, that's why. It's a good job, good effort play. We got about four minutes left in this uh, third quarter. Saints are up by, looks to be 15. You know what would make this game entertaining? Half court shots. Just half court shots all time. All the time. Yeah. I like it. No defense, just half court shots. Uh oh. For a, for a second there, I was about to say good pass to the post, and then I realized it was the opposite post, and I was like, not a good pass. Not at all, sir. Not at all. 24. At least Charles goes with the box up. There we go. Great Good to hustle, Alex is not making friends. He is a man on a mission. And that mission is for blood. And balls. Wow. <laughs> I meant basketball. Oh balls, my goodness. Now just Let's get our minds out of I the I think gunners. most people assume that you just 
You just made it bad. Okay. Now come on, Ethan. My uh oh, God, uh oh, sir. guys, take a knee. We got an injury here. We'll take an uh, injury timeout right here. Hey, Mr. Injury Producer, timeout. man. And that's my line. And we're back. Dallas tried to steal my line, and he's still here for some reason. Student guest, Dallas Hammer. The whole third quarter, sir. I'm here. All right. All right. Okay. Brandon Wall, top of the key, dribbling around. Nice pass. Charles. Just you great know. moving on the ball right there. You awesome. know. He's one of the strong young players for this team that I can see having a future here. Yeah, great effort. He's very coordinated. As long knows, as, we, as, long as we don't trade him, we'll lose him to free agency. Yeah. Brandon Wall going up. Alex Graves. Uh-uh. Yeah, just lost control of the ball right there. That's going to be called back, ladies and gentlemen, travel on Alex Graves. And I know he doesn't want to think that's true, but it is. Sometimes the truth can hurt, Ethan. Sometimes the truth can have a voice crack. Dallas. Yes, just like me. Yes. Indeed. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. My puberty just started. <laughs> yeah, it did. And it started yeah. hard. Sorry I missed that shot. I was busy giggling about Dallas's puberty. All right. Brandon passes to Charles. Inside, Zach Jones. Post move. Jackson. Trevor. Zach Jones. Foul. You know if the Saints get in there and start playing rough basketball, they're just going to get fouls yeah. every call. That was a good fight for the ball. Way to put it back up. Way to draw the foul. I say, you can't call a foul. I mean, you can't help but call a foul. After yeah, that, yeah. After it was, that many it was like a mosh pit down there. That was crazy. Number 15 is coming back in the game. That's a good sign for Madison. Yeah, I think he just got a little banged up. I'll tell you what. Even though Zach Jones is one of our big men, I'd say he might have the best free throw stroke in the game of basketball. Yeah, yeah, he does, he does. Well, not in the entire game of basketball, but in this no, in particular this basketball team. In yes. this particular game of basketball. Either him or Trevor. Trevor's got a pretty Brandon's, pure shot. Brandon's been sinking them lately. Yeah, he just needs to draw more fouls. That is true. Here we go, Zach Jones. Well, I think that makes Zach Jones three for four for the game. Still a pretty decent free throw percentage. It seems that Bain has revealed his identity. Oh, my goodness. Nice pass from number four there. Oh, they're going to call that a foul. You know, who would you call their star player of Madison? I'd say probably number one, number one or number 11. Those are the two best players. Number 11 has a pretty solid shot. I do like his shot. He's a good big man with a turnaround J. Yep. And 24, I haven't seen him yet. Is he coming in Stroking now? Stroking the free throw. No, no. Oh, I didn't see him either. I didn't either. Oh, that's all right. He got a pretty good stroke himself. I'd say, I'd say 15 is probably one of their... Uh, he's, a, he's a solid post. They're one of their... Uh, Building blocks for the future. Brandon Wall to Jackson Harrell. That's a shot, ladies and gentlemen. Unfortunately, can't go down. Gets the offensive rebound one more time. Can't go down. And I tell you what, Dallas, there have been a lot of fouls in this game. A lot of missed shots, a lot of fouls. But on the good side, there's been a lot of effort. Yes, there has. Wow, that's Jackson's fourth foul. Did you hear that? No, I didn't. I didn't hear that. That is Jackson's fourth foul. I think that means one more and he's out Yeah, of he's here. in trouble. We cannot afford to lose him going into the fourth quarter with only a 15-point lead. Well, where was that pass directed to? This is a way to get the ball back, though. Oh, and we lost it again. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Off the shoe of number four. Trevor getting a little bit into it. Spicy. Spicy like a chicken. 
Feels like a mongoose stalking his prey. Yeah. Ellis, it's been good talking to you. I know you got to go soon. Yeah. Well, I mean, not too soon. We still got another. But yeah, we still got the rest of the third. Another two minutes with you, but how's school going for you, Dallas? You know, I've missed the last couple of days. I had a viral infection, but, you know, I think I can get back to the swing of things soon. And let me just say, our scoreboard director, our producer, Blake Branham, has just been doing a fantastic job updating the scores. 55, Blake. Yes. There we go. This is truly the pinnacle of broadcasting. I'm just loving the teamwork all around here. I can really tell. Charles passing it in to Brandon. Sweet stroke, Excuse a me. little bit over. Charles, look at that effort from the, the, the young guys are just playing with so much heart. What? That's some good transition, D. I'll tell you what, if he could make his layups, that kid would just, number four would just be out of this world. Yes, but with age comes experience. He just needs to get a little bit older. You were merely born into the darkness, Dallas. No, I mean, you were merely raised in the darkness, Dallas. I was born into it. Are you it. talking about Bane? Again? No, Dallas, I'm just saying some. Gosh. All right, look at that. Brandon Wall coming up the floor. Pass. Shot. Trevor. 11. Rebound. Yeah, you know, we're just not sinking our threes tonight. We're not sinking much, many shots. Wow, he just threw it straight off the shoe. That looks like a kicked ball violation by Trevor. I think it was Brandon. Actually. It was Brandon? Yep. We got about Zach Jones going off. And uh, who came on for him, do you know? Uh, Gilbert Russ. Gilbert Russ, fan favorite. Number four, driving in. Oh, Ooh. my goodness. That was a sick reverse layup. Sick, nasty. Woo. I'm going to have to catch my breath. I'm getting a little nauseous from that. The amount of skill. The amount of downright skill. I said get number four the ball again because he is just draining. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. It's okay. You're sick. It's an, oh, my. Well, he mishandled it a little bit. A little bit of a mishandle. 35 will get back in there, though. So there's number 31. He'll get back in there. Oh, oh Gilbert Russ just wide, wide open. Wide open. Oh, and he got rejected. Excellent block from behind. I tell you, 15 is not too bad. 15 is actually probably one of their top you know, three players. You know, the segments are waning in the third quarter. We need to get a play set up, get it going. 23.9, I'd say. Is there a shot clock in high school basketball? No, there's not. But All right, well, we can do whatever So they can we hold want. it all they, want, all they want. Well, that would be unfortunate. You know, we just need Number to get four at the top of the key. Uh-oh, uh-oh, 11. The big man. I told you. I told. What did I tell you? Good I, shot, but we got enough time to get us a play in. I told you. Ten 11. seconds on the clock. Why are we hurrying it up? Should have kept it for the last possession. Now no, that, that's what we needed to do. We just needed to set up, make a good shot, go into the fourth quarter. You, you know, and those kind of decisions come with maturity and experience. Exactly. And we got a very young team. Very and you young know what? We'll learn that. We'll learn that as it goes on. Exactly. Number eleven. Oh. I'd say because I don't think I don't think Gilbert or uh, Alex have played until this year, but they're both pretty key role players. Yeah, for our team. All right. Well, I had a great time, Ethan. I had a fun time Congra commentating with you. Congrats. Blake, I'm gonna hand it back to you, man. Congratulations. It was nice talking to you. Glad I'm back at school. Uh, I'm in, I am too. All right. We'll go now to our commercial break. No. Hello. Yo, what's up? We're back here. We've got Cameron on the mic. Hello, dear MJCA. I am the quiz buster of this night of fun and adventure. Tell us a fun fact, Cameron, from Quiz Busters. Here's a fun fact. <laughs> All right. I'm looking forward to this. My First, I have a question for you, Ethan Palmer. Uh, drop the beat. 
All right. Do you know what type of mic we're using right now? I'd have to say this is one of those uh, hypercardioid mics. The correct answer is hypercardioid. Congratulations. Ooh. Did I spell it correctly? Spell it real quick. H-Y-P-E-R. Correct. Yes. That's a bingo. That is a bingo. <laughs> All right. Like seven, love the trouble here. Ever since he's stopped commentating, he just does not know how to focus. Poor guy. Is that 3D? <laughs> yeah, our picture. <laughs> PS3 TV. Trevor West with the inbound pass up to Brandon Wall. And you know what he's going to do, ladies and gentlemen. He's going to get inside and pass it to the Zach Jones. Yep. Zach Jones got rejected. The reason it is fuzzy tonight, folks, it is because we are presenting the first 3D MJCA broadcast. So if you have a Sony PSP TV, PS3 TV, would you please insert any old glasses, your glasses? Any old glasses will do. You We've can use rigged them. it to wear sunglasses, oh. Ray-Bans, all of the sorts are 3D now. You can use those ones from the you theater. You can thank us later. You can pop out the eye, eye hole things, and still watch it in 3D. It's pretty phenomenal. <laughs> Here is a fun fact for you, Ethan. Hello. It rains diamonds on Neptune and Uranus. That's crazy. I bet oh, you I, thought that, that. I thought that was a question, and I was like, I, I don't even know. No, the truth. Oh, okay. That's what it is. That's a fun fact. Is that not fun? I wish it was raining diamonds, because you know, you then know we'd all be rich. You know what they but say. Then the value of diamonds would go down tremendously due to the excess of diamonds, and well, that's called inflation, my son. You know what they say. Men are from, from Mars and women are from Venus. <laughs> you know how the old saying goes. You know, the old parable. Boys go to Mars to get more cars. Girls go to Jupiter to get more Jupiter. No offense. A absolutely fantastic. Is that a good... Oh. So, let's talk about some current events <coughs> going on right now. Obama was reelected. I heard. I saw that on the news. That was big. Yeah. Just recently. And that was Nick Blevins for you who uh, heard it. Coming down from Somebody. Chattanooga. Nick Blevins, get on the microphone right now. Nick Blevins, a personal hero of mine. Here's a fun fact. Johnny Depp and Queen Elizabeth are related. No way. Mind equals blown, MJCA. Johnny Depp is from Kentucky. That is a dirty lie, and you take it back. It's true. It's the truth. I saw it on the internet. Can't be false. Can't be false. I don't know what you said, but it sounded interesting. Ooh. Oh, yeah, he is. That's the connection. That's how he got that job. I'm so British. Oh, wow, I am not following this action. Uh, you see my friends come up here, and I just get distracted. If you work the camera at the next time out, I, I will let you comment. No, not right now. Okay. And I'm back, MJCA. Dallas Hammer. Great shot by number 11. Nice put up. Brandon Wall taking it up the court. Back to Brandon from Trevor. Zach with the pump fake and pass, and he passes it to no one, Cameron. How about that? That's awful. We can't have that. That's just a series of unfortunate events. Right there. I agree. And sorry, I had to adjust my mic. You know, we have some bumping music in our...
before we get back, I have another fun fact for you, Dallas Hammer. Did you know that seven out of two fractions are improper? I don't understand. I don't get it. Well, seven out of two people don't understand fractions. That's the problem. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's an epidemic, I tell you. Nice drive by number 11, blocked by Zach. It's an epidemic, I tell Passed you. Passed out to number one. Number 11 gets the ball again, passes it down to the post, and... Oh, that was a ticky-tack foul, wouldn't you say? <laughs> all made it a ticky-tacky. And they all look just the same. True that. You know, this might not be our best game to tonight, but we've been playing pretty darn hard. Wouldn't you say so, Cameron? I'd say that the greatest reward is knowing that we tried our hardest. Exactly. That's, that's my motto. That's how you got to look at it every game. That's the motto. YOLO. I'll tell you what, 31's got a quirky shot, but it is working for him. Quirky is the word. Good drive by Brandon. Shot. Oh. He has just not been on tonight, but he's been playing his hardest. Ball one. Grab bat by number one. Number one at the top. Drives down. Out of control. That is a charge, sir. Wazzle yes, sir. I As don't even know what that Ethan means. Would say. That was a great job. You guys. If there's one thing we're good at, it is drawing charges. We're like an artist. We we've got a very young and inexperienced team, but we've got some talent. Hey I'll tell you that. Hey man. We're doing real good. We have, we have. Whoa. And just a bunch of falling Wait. on the court. I'm not sure what just happened. Has Bane been unmasked? But Bane, yes, Bane is unmasked. And he just made a great scramble for the ball and laid it up. What a shot from Trevor. What a good player. Ah, uh, just goes in and out. It just seems that the balls aren't bouncing <coughs> our way. <coughs> Only positive talk. Uh, I'm not sure what. Oh, it seems that there's a foul. Charles with his fourth foul. The Saints are in some foul trouble. Number 15 up at the line. <laughs> you know what would come in handy, Cameron? A name sheet. Handy, Cameron. A name sheet? Yeah. yeah. They usually give us one, but, you know, this time they like, nah. Yeah, this one kind of got thrown together. It happens. Yeah. But we're, do we're doing a pretty good job. Good a draw Ballin'. by Zach. Nice job. I've you know, let's told that's his habit. He's been, he's been sinking some free throws. Let's see if we can sink them here tonight, right here. Throws up the first, rims out. Are you attending Coach C's birthday party after the game? No, I did see it on Facebook, though. I hear there's a birthday party for everyone that is invited, which is everyone, at his house. After the game. Zach with another smooth stroke. And there we go. He's back on it. Looks like we're breaking out the full court press. And number one steps out of bounds and travels. Oh, no. Not a good combination. No. Oh, no. Charles, good pass. Ah, oh, great defensive play by number four. They bring it back down the court. The Knights with the ball. Hello. 15 takes a 15 footer and rims out. It'll be Saints ball. Yep, it will be. Oh, Ethan, you're back. And you are now doing play-by-play, -play and I'll do color. I don't really. It's one mic on. Yeah, it is. All right. Well, uh, I don't really know where I went there for a minute. 
I blacked out, woke up. Back but you're okay. That's all that matters. I feel a little bit funny. My knees are weak, but I'm here. Seems I, seems I. I'll tell you what. My nose is runny as all get out. It's a lot of get out. <laughs> and just to get this clear, I invited no one to a Coach C's birthday party. Cameron did invite everyone. He is the ripe young age of 33. A truly beautiful soul, if you ask me. Unparalleled in beauty. A coach, a coach with such intensity and fire in his eyes. Our teacher. He's not a coach. He's not just a coach. He's a life coach. And a teacher. And the teacher. <laughs> Number four taking free throws. Showing some great potential. That's an odd setup for a free throw, but it works for him. It works for him. Well, it obviously didn't work there, Dallas. I mean, look at the hey, I'll bet you $5 he sinks it. How about that? I did not accept any bet, so... Not endowed to owe you. Great pass by Brandon. This tripod is just giving me nightmares. Yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you what. We need a new tripod. Good pass out by Zach. Brandon doesn't take the three. He's been a little off tonight, so Back smart up. play by Brandon. Clears it out. Sets up the play. Goes around the other side. He's just a dribbling master. That looks Good like pass a, to Trevor. I was about to say, that looks like Trevor should have taken that three. But you know what works. Looks like, looks like we're holding the ball, protecting it a little bit. Oh, it, is, it has gotten a lot closer. Oh, no. And a late foul call, but I think number four is hurt. Uh-oh. Oh, no, he was wearing that mask. Before. Yeah, I'm telling you, if he would have wore the mask, maybe that not, might not have happened. Well, I mean, it looks like he got hit in the face, which isn't good. It looks like an eye. Puts up his first shot. There's a lot of ambient noise around me. Can you not tell? Good vocab. Yep. <laughs> and Wawa Woozle, MJC. That's almost the end of the fourth quarter. It's actually a timeout, but let's cut to the timeout. And we're back, MJCA. Dallas stole my thunder. I yeah. did again, and I like it. I don't know where I am on this court. Oh, there I am. Oh, he's put his mask back on. A smart decision by number four. He seems to be a little prone to getting hit in the face. Excuse any ambient noise. That is not associated with the MJCA broadcast. Way to put that in. That's a good job. Just gotta let it get out of here. Because we got some people talking loud in the background, you know? You know what I'm saying? Uh oh, number 11. Number 11. Oh, and a charge call on number 11. And Blake stole my chair. That's a good job by Alex taking the charge. Okay, well, we got Trevor passing it in here. Two minutes left. We just need to protect the ball, play smart. 
What's the score to this game? 63 to 55. And it is still the first period, it looks like, on the screen. Cameron, would you like to change it to the fourth quarter? It's been the first quarter for about 10, 40 minutes or whatever it is. Sorry about that, folks. Submit that overlay. Whoa, Blake, you little cheeky <laughs> monkey over there. You know that it's been the first quarter since the first quarter? Yeah. You no, didn't you didn't change it, it Blake. <laughs> We're sorry for any inconvenience. Yes, it's been the These first. people must have been so confused. I want to like what quarter is well, it? Well, I was just, I was just facing the wrong end of the stadium right there for about this, five minutes. This, this is just pish posh. Look Wyatt that. puts up another free throw. Look at that beautiful and picture quality. Good effort by Brent to get the ball back, but it's in vain because it goes out of bounds. But we did get the ball back. So, yep. Um. Let's see what we can do with this. This is really uh, Madison's. You know, strong. I'm not an expert on basketball, but it looks like we just need to clear it out. Wait, never mind. We go up with a quick play. I Eleven we gets the ball back. I thought we were going to set up and you know leak the some game time out. Off the clock, exactly. but, oh well, there's a steal from Madison. That is not what you want to see out of those. Trevor goals. drives down, passes it to Brandon. Now we should. Now we're setting it up. There we go. There we go. There's no rush here, boys. There's no rush. Uh-oh. Where's the foul call there, sir? Trevor. Trevor setting it up. Good job. Dribbles to the other side of the court, passes it to Brandon. Brandon in a little bit of trouble. Uh-oh, they trapped him. Oh, Passes it to Charles. Charles drives down. Charles. No time for setup in. Good. Nice basket. Good job, Charles. Nice drive, nice basket by the freshman, Charles. Charles is a freshman? Charles is a freshman, I think. This is news to me. Is is that correct? Charles is a freshman. Let's let's pull up the stats. Is Charles a freshman? Let me just check my watch here. Charles, Charles is a freshman, and he is a great freshman at that. Truly poised to become one of the best of all, all time. Is he is? Folks, <coughs> best of all time. Now, are we talking about MJCA history or uh, NBA or college? I'd say, he's stay, I'd say he stacks up there right next to Jordan. Universe? We'll call him best player in the universe. A little bit better than Kobe, a little bit less than Jordan. And it looks like Alex just got teed up, and that is his fifth foul, too. How did Alex get teed up? What I am not do? sure. It looks like he just jawed to another ref. Well, that's not going to get you anywhere in life. Keeping your mouth shut always gets you somewhere. Am yeah. I right? Respect authority. Authority will and respect 24 you. 24 makes both his free throws, and they've dwindled the lead to eight points. Now, eight points in a one-minute span will be truly a miracle. Maybe better. But miracles always happen. I don't know, man. You don't know what's going to happen. This is basketball. It's very unpredictable, the last this is a man's, few minutes of a basketball a, game. This is a man's sport. Pass up. 11. Looks like they're in a bit of a, a hurry up. 11 has it. Uh -oh. There we go. And throws up an air ball. Good effort by number four trying to get the ball back in play, but. You see number four Saints help ball. number four up? That was yeah, beautiful. that was oh, great display of sportsmanship. It's just like how the their scores were divisible by seven at the first quarter. Oh, wow. What's going on there? Way to control the ball by Brandon. That's 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 just experience showing itself right there. He is a senior and he knows what he's doing. It's pretty obvious. You know, this team has the perfect mix of senior leadership and young talent. I'd still I'd still say that we have a, a, a little bit to go. As we do, we do. We have a lot of improvement, but, you know, that's, that's always a good thing. That's what's encouraging about this. Exactly. And Brandon makes his free throw. Great, great shot. He does have a pretty shot. All you right. know what his shot reminds me of? Who? A big old pile of butter melting on a oh, stack of flat I, I hear you right there. Woo! Just that was sweet. Smooth. When it hits the Jay back of the rim. Smooth. When it hits the back of the rim, it goes, Quah! It's great. I don't think it makes that noise in particular. Yeah, it does. It doesn't make the quah noise. It does in my world. 
Nice slap away. And, oh, and oh, good hustle. Brant is a hustler, I'll tell you what. It looks like we just need to set up the ball and, and you know, drain that, the clock right here. That looks here. like it might be the end of the game unless we have another it foul does. here. We might, we might get another foul call right here, yep. And now it's just a, a uh, make some free throws and drain the clock situation now. Yeah, for sure. I'll tell you what, I need some NyQuil. You need to go home and take a nap. Take a sleep, that's what you need to do. Nap? It's, it's 9 o'clock, sir. And it isn't our best friend, Garrett. Dallas is rambunctious. I think I've said the word rambunctious like 20 times. During this. I think you have. It's okay. You know what? He's a cool guy. His little brother. Oh, nice move by number four. And he misses the free throw. Great or layup. I'm Great telling you what, 15's going to play college ball. I don't know where, but he's going to play college ball. Don't know. You know what I'm saying? No, no one else. He's four. Now, it's kind of a question to me why they're still fouling. With I know. Eight, eight, eight seconds, seconds to go, eight, point eight points. It's I would say they literally. This game is just about over. Yeah. Brandon not able to hit his free throw. That's a strange sight. Exactly. So over there. Don't you dare. Who, who gives you a shout out? Don't you dare on hook us. Garrett is giving a shout out to. Miss Christensen, who we're pretty who sure is watching the who game. is watching the game at the moment. Garrett loves you. And we love you too. Oh, wow. Ladies and gentlemen, that camera. 